Those weren't soldiers in the church, I'm sure of it. I heard the screams of women when our gas shells hit. The others say I'm imagining things, but I know what I heard. I think Rosala knows too. He was the one who fired the shells, and his face was as white as chalk afterward. I shall go and look tonight. I need to know for sure.
We have anything to eat. We have even had to dismiss Frau Adler. And my dear Frau Bruegel. Oh, because Karl and his maniacs started this horrible war. Hall has also travelled to the front now. But I have not heard from him. He is just like his father. But my Johanna still writes to me. I am counting the days until I have him back. He doesn't want to come back to our house because of Carl. Maybe he will go away with me. Perhaps to Santa Balbine.
I was right. By God, there were civilians in the church. I tried to tell our newly minted Leutnant what I saw, but he didn't want to hear it. He laughed. He said I shouldn't act like such a crybaby in front of the men, and the Supreme Army Command know what they are doing. But he knows I warned him about the church. I don't recognize him anymore. What have they done to him? I shall try to talk to the doctor. Perhaps there are survivors.
church was Notre Dame. The elderly must have refused to leave their village and sought shelter with Our Lady instead. Where was she? What will she do to us when she discovers what we have done? And what about us? What of our own fates? The front devours all before it, and we have turned the world into hell on earth. Only the devil hears our prayers. Whoa! 
I bet he's not even got hair on his balls yet. <laughs> hmm, better not get those boots dirty.
That's meant to be, aren't you, Lieutenant? Someone should wipe that smug grin off his face. I give him two weeks in the trenches. He won't be laughing then. He'll be off back home to Mummy in no time. In a wooden box, most likely. <laughs> Lay off, lads. Give him a chance, at least. Sometimes I do not know whether I am dreaming or awake. Whether I am here in the trenches or at home in Berlin. Mother is trying with all her strength to get me to come home. But I don't want to go back. to him, but I don't know if he understood what I was saying.
That's meant to be, aren't you, Lieutenant? Someone should wipe that smug grin off his face. I give him two weeks in the trenches. He won't be laughing then. 
He'll be off back home to mummy in no time. In a wooden box, most likely. <laughs> Lay off, lads. Give him a chance, at least. That's meant to be, our new lightning? Someone should wipe that smug grin off his face. I give him two weeks in the trenches. He won't be laughing then. He'll be off back home to mummy in no time. In a wooden box, most likely. <laughs> Lay off, lads. Give him a chance, at least. Ah! Uh. 
Did they run out of real men? Everything's getting smaller these days. Leutnant is nothing but a little prince playing dress-up. A milksop for an officer? They don't give a rotting turd about us. Damn it. Damn it all. We used to eat runts like him for breakfast back at school. The upper class is here in the trenches. The rats will be delighted. Have we got any more canned milk? He'll need to grow up big and strong if he wants to make Daddy proud. Company, attention! 27 men present and correct, Herr Leutnant. Why does everyone seem to think I have some kind of influence over our new Leutnant and the chain of command? Do they think I can stop the churning of the war machine with my bare hands? As much as it pains me to say it, the only thing we have in common is our accursed name.
As if these damned trenches, this damned war, weren't enough. Now the curse of my name has followed me too. From our home out here to the front. Everyone can sense it. It creeps through the trenches, stalking us. The only one who cannot see it is our new loitment. Finally. Is that you, soldier? Was that you by the plane? My eyes. I can't see a thing. But they cannot deceive me anymore. It's all lies. None of it is true. None of it! A Supreme Army Command. I must inform Supreme Command. The Kaiser needs to know what's happening here. Isn't over. The enemy is here. We have to win the war. Do you hear? For the fatherland. And for ourselves. Don't listen to the traitors and deserters. <laughs> Please, you have to help me. <laughs> Give me something to calm my nerves. <laughs> something for the pain. There's 
A medical transport to the north. Please. My, my eyes. God, my eyes. The enemy. They were in my head. I saw.
The boy will go far. Father always said so. It was his dying wish. Your father is gone. He built this house for himself, no one else. Me defend him, of all places. All so he could send your harness to the Cadet Academy. And now Paul, too. More heirs, more soldiers. That's all I was ever good for. The Academy would have done Johannes the power of good. You've seen for yourself what your coddling has done to him. It's a disgrace.
Oh mon dieu, c'est un fils You know I won't tolerate that language under my roof Your father's words again You cannot even speak for yourself Where has my husband gone Nonsense Father was right You've already warped one of my sons with your hysteria I won't allow you to ruin the other Where has my husband gone Once Paul leaves I shall be all alone in this house Just me And me Thank you.